a fish from the Matrix here. Ninja fish. Oh, God. Hello, everybody, and welcome to three random games about fishing or fish. I don't know. I'm still just recording it. These games are games that uh, are either too short, too slow, or are uh, just better off suited as just a bunch of YouTube uh, videos. So with that in mind, this is going to be exclusive to YouTube and it is not a stream. And uh, today's theme is apparently fish or fishing. Still don't know about that. First game on today's list is Flippy Fish. Keep Flippy alive. You play as Flippy, an unlucky fish whose life will soon come to a tragic end, unless it manages to slip between the hands of the sushi master who wants to transform it into Maki. Jump and roll with talent to avoid the knife and blowtorch preying on you, but be prepared as you evade him, the sushi master will get angrier. His attacks will grow more vicious and your life will hang by a scale. Uh, this is my first Ichio game, I guess. Let's begin. I love the opening music, by the way. I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh god. Oh no! Oh yeah! Okay, cool. So there's like a... Oh shit, no! Oh, okay. Oh god. Oh no, I'm dead! What the hell is this music? I love it. Oh, I'm the angriest sushi. Oh no. Oh, that was terrible. Let me try that again. <gasps> oh. oh no. Okay, I'm still too slow. So I gotta time the knife and I gotta turn for the fire. What is this music? It's so good. <laughs> In like a meme way. Like it's legit good, but it reminds me of a meme. Haha, <laughs> bitch! Oh shit. Oh no, he's comboing on me. No, 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 I went right into it. Damn it. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. I just realized that like half of the words in that song that plays while we played is what? <laughs> it's nani? Nani? All right, bring it on, man. Ooh. Yeah, I'm getting a hang of this. Woo! I hope this music is not copyrighted. Yeah! This is really fun! Like, this is legit fun! All I know is you, avocado. I even take him out of my California rolls. Which I know isn't true sushi, but get over it. Ugh. I am, like, a fish from the Matrix here. Ninja fish. Oh god! Oh god. Little fish, I'm so sorry. Stay alive. How the fuck did you get in this situation? Why don't they kill you before preparing you for sushi? Ah. Ah. <laughs> it's like the worst jump rope. This is like harder than Doom d Jump Rope. Oh uh, no! Oh god, no, they're get- No! Shit! Well then- That singer- Something's happening with him. <laughs> oh god. No, I did it wrong! No! Aww. I'm sorry, little fish. I've tried my best. <laughs> you look so fucking pissed. I'm so sorry. All right, I think I've shown what there is to show with this game. I've, 
highly recommend this game. I enjoyed it. It's a bit short, but it's a great little arcade game and it was a ton of fun. On to the next one. Our next game is Mouse Boat. Play as a mouse and sail around a pond. Fish will appear as small shadows in the water. Cast your rod and try to catch some fish. Any fish you keep are saved. There are 14 fish with varying degrees of rarity and difficulty. Catch them all. Is that a challenge? Oh man, this game is so chill. Just immediately, good vibes. Let's figure out how to fish. Go oh, left mouse to reel in the fish. Get the blue bar to zero to catch the fish. The red bar of the line is strength and don't let it snap. When an arrow appears, the fish is struggling. Keep reeling and push your movement keys to in the same direction as the arrow or else the line strength will get worse. Okay. So... So this is basically like most mini games in uh most fishy mini games in uh large games like Monster Hunter stuff. Except Monster Hunter is like the most simplistic forms, I know. <gasps> Look at us! We're so cute! We're just a mouse. Alright, so we uh there's a fish. Oh god, it's massive. Don't worry about it. The fish does not give a one shit. Damn it, okay. So I think I figured it out now. Hey, you look big. Let me get you. Yeah. Oh, thanks, say, Don't be a bastard about it. Let me murder you for the sake of trophyism. That didn't work. Okay, then. Oh, wow, this is just so fucking chill. If I was the fish, though, I'd be afraid of being eaten by a. Or if I was the. If I was the mouse, I would be afraid to be eaten by the fish. Notice me, senpai. There we go. Wait for it. Ah, oh, damn it! Alright, still have not figured this out, and that's okay. Oh, okay. Still figuring this out. Still okay. I was saying this is a chill game, but this game is surprisingly difficult. That or I'm just really not getting it. God, that is the tiniest fish ever. You have to realize I'm a mouse who is mouse size. That fish is small, even compared to me. The tiny ass fish, probably like a tadpole or something. Ah, oh, yeah. Got a guppy. Okay, so it's guppy. It, it, even though they're small, they're like normal size. Okay, I get it. <laughs> Got a guppy. Let's keep it, because I, I want one of each fish. I caught a neon tetra. Aren't those like only sold in stores though? They're like the bioluminescent ones that we, we you know, splice together, right? Oh well, mine now. All right, I still suck ass at catching fish. Good to know. I caught a goldfish. His name is Goldie. Most original name ever. I feel like any second now, the cast of Splash Mountain is gonna show up playing the banjo. That's not necessarily a bad thing, but... <laughs> any second now, a large bird is gonna fly down and just grab us. Ah, yeah! It's a killifish! It's a fish that murders everybody you know and love! Keep it! Keep it in your pocket! Forever! You never know when you'll want a murder fish. So can I go, like, back home? I don't know what will happen then. It's a tadpole! It's so cute! I love tadpoles, especially, uh, pollywogs. 
I found out that Poliwog in like other countries and even other parts of the US doesn't mean what it means here. Here, Poliwog is specifically at the tadpole stage where they look like a frog with a tail, which is by far my favorite looking stage. Um, but apparently in like Great Britain and stuff, it's literally just another word for tadpole. So I find that kind of interesting. I wonder what Tom Sawyer motherfucker convinced everyone that Polywog was the official name of this specific age range of frog metamorphosi. That's that's the plural for metamorphosis, sure. Totally not me just making up a word. It's a bitterling! It's a wee bit bitter that you caught it. Ha 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 ha! It's gonna die now. Yeah, it's a pale chub. It's a wee bit chubby, isn't it? Actually, no, it's, it's, it's a skinny motherfucker. Why is it called a chub? Don't fight me, bitch. It's a fathead minnow. His head is not particularly fat. I've definitely got the hang of it now. I could say at the very least. It's a pond smelt! Did you sme I mean smell it first? Uh ha ha, I should write the Animal Crossing, uh, lines. Woo. I love the little boop as it hits the water. Oh, my first repeat! Keep it, because why the fuck not? <laughs> Take that camera. Actually, we can get a good look at ourselves this way. We are adorable. Look at us. Yeah. All right. Let's let's see how many more I got. Fish caught. That's a lot of fish. That's a lot of fish. I've caught twelve so far. Probably the bigger boys is what I need to focus on now. I lost a lot of them at the beginning. Oh, there's like a waterfall over there. I don't even go to it. How am I controlling this leaf? Here, this waterfall. That's nice. Take a shower real quick. Yeah. No secret under there. <laughs> Video games have conditioned me to assume that there's secret caves underneath every one or every waterfall. I think the bigger ones are more likely to come out along the edge. I don't know if that's actually like how it was designed or if that is just the coincidence I have had. Yeah, there we go. There's a big one. Probably. If I get like a big mouth bass or some shit like that, what the hell? <laughs> Alright, everybody. Alright everybody, I am gonna call it there for today. Uh, you're gonna have to play the game yourself to check out the last two fish. Consider that, uh, your incentive to play this game yourself. It's a nice, cute little game. I enjoyed it. It was chill as fuck. Uh, the music is great, but I do think if I was gonna spend a lot more time on this, I'd probably mute it eventually. I don't know. I think this would be a nice, cute, small, simple game for when you just need to relax a little bit. And, uh, the learning curve is a bit interesting, but once I figured it out, it was easy as pie. Except for those big fish, I never figured that part out, but whatever, I'm stupid. Alright, on to the next game! Yeah! <laughs> All right, next up is Clawfish, a fish claw game, I think. <laughs> this one's going to be interesting. Use a claw machine arm to harness the just about endless supply of fish right in your own living room. Grab as many fish as you can within the set time limit. Faster fish give more points. Include a regular mode where fish stay, ups stay upside up in rotating mode that does a lot of wonky physics stuff. Ooh. Definitely gonna be looking at that. Born from the wisdom that any game is made better by being able to fish in it, Clawfish was created during a two half day game jam by a group of students who only know fishing from video games. Sounds like an absolute treat. So let's check out this game. 
Oh god, my ears! Why? Why? Why is this the music? Oh god! Why? End me! End this suffering! Oh god, okay, um... Ooh, we got a beat now! Yay! Got fish! My fish. We're just playing normal mode first. Yeah! I want that fast fish. I think I can murder the fish. I don't know if it counts if I murder them. Answer is probably not. <gasps> I got the... No, damn it. Fuck you, fast fish. This is fun. It's very simple, though. I thought I would have to, like, pick and choose the fish. Like, really think it out like an actual crane game. I'm not complaining. This is still fun. The fish are... Uh, they stop moving after a bit. I think that's, like, the best time to grab most of the fish. Did I just spawn in a fish on the way up? Up we go! Oh god, they're flying! Oh god, they're getting out! Oh god! Oh no! It looks like a glitch. Their eyes. They want out of this existence. Okay, um, let's start, uh, rotating mode, I guess. Okay. Oh god, no! Oh no! Oh no, look at them! Oh, this is like way funner. Just look at them! <laughs> you poor bastards! This is how you kill all your fish. I feel like they made the game, and then they like accident- it, like they could've- they had this like glitch, as a glitch for a certain amount of time. And then, uh, when they fixed it, they're like, Oh, it's just not as much fun anymore, though. So they put it back in as the form of another mode or something. Like, th th at some point, they're like, Let's remove the stationary rotation. Oh god, the fish! <laughs> I thought they were flying out before. The poor bastard. It's a lot harder. you would just swim normally. Oh god. Oh no. They're everywhere. Oh no. <laughs> Watch them go. Fly off to their doom. To be despawned off screen. All right. Um, that was a fun little game. Very short. Uh, really interesting. Great idea. I enjoyed it. Um, I do recommend it, however, I don't recommend going through like the trouble of downloading it. They do have a browser version, and I think that would probably be a much better way, because this is a very, very short game. Um, I did enjoy it, though. And do recommend it. Alright, everybody, I think I'm gonna call it there for today. I hope you enjoyed this, uh, first ever, uh, random games from my particular channel. And I hope to make these a regular thing. My current plan is to have ran two videos a week, with one being normal random games and the other one being horror random games. So if you're not a fan of horror, you can just watch the uh, one normal video every week. And if you are a fan of horror, then you have the horror one later on. Uh, and I hope to make this a regular thing, hopefully. These do take a little bit more time because I do need to edit them after the fact, but I I can record them whenever I want, though, so trade-offs, I guess. And I hope you guys enjoyed, and join me next time. See you guys. Thank you so much for coming by. Please join me next time. I love you, and bye bye <laughs>
何？